guys welcome back to my channel so i have a collective haul i'm doing this in my room because shannon didn't go to school again all day yesterday she was coughing and all this morning so i've been giving her some medication for the cough now she didn't have the cough when it started but and leland's sick now so i'm pretty sure i'm gonna get it even though i've been cleaning everything that she touches making sure i clean it before he touches it he's still around her so i he it's gonna happen so i'm just really hoping that ben my husband doesn't get it because he just it's gonna suck if he has to call off from work um for me i mean i'm around the kids 24 7 way more than he is so i'm sure i'm gonna get it but i have a huge collective haul i don't feel like cutting it in half i don't feel like doing separate videos so i'm just gonna do it all in one because it's quite a few stores but it's a few things from each store um i got my new shirt finally i ordered it online it says i came i saw i had anxiety so i left like i saw this shirt and i immediately was like i need that in my life because it's so true it's so me i love it it's really soft anyways we're gonna start with um tj maxx i found this and i wasn't gonna get it but Shannon really wanted it. And he's just a cute little chubby gnome. He's like a teal, mint, greenish color. And then he's holding a jack-o'-lantern. And then he has like the little buckle. He just has black feet. So, I mean, if you really wanted to, you could like cut the jack-o'-lantern off and you could just like leave him year round. But I mean, he is wearing a witch's hat. So he is Halloween. He was only $9.99. So I got him, I had to, um, because I don't have a big Halloween gnome, I only have the little ones. Um, I'm going to be doing my house tour hopefully tomorrow, I hope she goes to school, um, if, and I hope she starts feeling better, I mean she's been playing and she's been, you know, so I feel like she's better, but she's coughing. So I got him, I was, like I said, I wasn't going to get him and then Shannon really wanted it. And then when I saw the price, I was like, yes, like that's not a bad deal for that big gnome. And then the only other thing I got from TJ Maxx, I was looking for, I don't have a fall tablecloth for my table on the patio. Um, the one I used last year doesn't fit. And I don't want to use my black and white buffalo check because like I was saying in a previous video, that one just feels more uh, Halloween to me then fall and my plaid one is ripped already so I just wanted to replace it TJ Maxx didn't have any but as I was going in the standing in line to check out I saw this and I was like oh I don't even have one and it's a cute list pad with a giant magnet on the back it comes with a pen it has a jack-o-lantern and candy corn and then it says notes and it was only $2.99 and it's 100 sheets. I'm probably not going to put this on my fridge, um, even though it has a huge magnet. I might set this on my table where I sit because um, I'm always writing stuff down and needing a piece of paper and it'll be right there. So I got this one and then this one is for friend mail and it says the witch is in and it has the witch standing right here. It has the spider web. It has a buffalo check border. And down here and then it comes with a gold striped pen and it was $2.99 also 100 sheets so I got one for me and one for a friend and that's all I got from TJ Maxx and then I went to Ross because Leland needs new shoes and I was like okay if I don't find him if I don't find him any shoes at Ross I'm just gonna order him some online well, I found these. I tried them on him. They're a little big, but I would rather them be big than be too small. Um, he still fits in his shoes right now. He He's not quite at the edge. So I just wanted to get these to have them ready for him for when he does need them. And that way he's gotten them. He gets them. So he chose Paw Patrol. They didn't really have a whole lot to choose from. Um, but like I said, they do fit him. And they do light up. And it has Chase and Marshall. Sorry. It's just... So I got Leland some new shoes. He ripped the price tag off, so I don't I don't remember how much they were. And then I found a tablecloth there, and I fell in love 
with the orange plaid. Like, I love that it has the orange and the gray and it's big enough that it will fit on my table. And it was $11.99, which that's not bad because I was looking on Amazon and all the ones that I found were way, way more than this one. I smell like a candle and I don't know why. Um, anyways, so I got this. I'm going to put this on my table and then I have one more thing and then I will be able to do my house tour. So I was really excited to find that at Ross. And then I also found this. I have one blanket from last year that I got at Ross and it's blue and it has pumpkins and it says grateful, thankful, blessed all over it. It's on my couch. Um, but I wanted another one and I found this really pretty orange one and it's my favorite color. So I, I mean, I can even use this one for Halloween and it was only $9.99. So I got that and that's it from Ross. Now I have Dollar General and 99 cent store. So there's a little bit more in these, st in, in these two stores than there was in the, um, the other ones. So I went to Dollar General, like I said, I was on the hunt for that table runner, but I, I appreciate everybody looking for it for me. Um, a dear friend of mine emailed me and told me she found it for me and she sent it out. So I don't need to look for it anymore, but I did find some stuff that I wanted to grab and I was really excited to find them. Um, like, hello. Yes. They were only a dollar. I had to get these. Um, I'm hoping to use these in my kitchen window. Last year I used Paw Patrol, Mickey Mouse, and PJ Masks, but those I'm going to put in Shannon's bathroom. So now that I know she likes window clings on her mirror, um, that is the other thing I need to do too. I need to put clings, but you will see, I picked up some at the 99 cent store, um, to add to her bathroom. Cause I do have some leftover, but none that really say like fall or like anything like that. But anyways, I picked up these. I want to put these ones in my kitchen window, but I have a feeling this one's going to be too big. So I might save this one, just this guy for a DIY. And then I'll put him in her and then like the extra spiders and bats but they're just window clings for a dollar and you get 12. So I got that one. Of course I had to get this one. It has the truck. It says jack-o'-lantern farms and there's some jack-o'-lanterns in the truck bed. And then it says trick or treat. There's ghosts and then there's bats and more jack-o'-lanterns. You get 12 in this one. It was also a dollar. And then Shannon wanted this one for her bathroom as well, plus the ones that I already have. Um, so there are a bunch of cats that are dressed up and then they're driving the truck. She's all about that truck too. So I had to get, she wanted those. I said that was fine. You get 11. And this one, I fell in love with the tree. Um, even the witch, I think I want to put her in the window. But if I decide to do a DIY, I might do the DIY with this one. And then I can just save the jack-o'-lanterns for my window. And then there is a cat right here. Um, this one you get 13. So I got those. I was really excited to find new window clings. Um, I also got some magnets. These two are for me. Um, they were each a dollar. This one says cutest pumpkin in the patch. You guys know I collect magnets. So like I said, it was only a dollar. It was hanging on a clip strip. And then this one says pumpkin kisses and harvest wishes. I'm going to put these on my fridge after this. And then this one's going to a friend um, because sometimes I call her pumpkin. Well, I don't call her pumpkin, but like I'm probably going to start calling her pumpkin. Um, it'll be a cute little nickname for her. But I'm going to send this to her. It was only a dollar. Like I said, it was, it's just round. It's the same thing. Cutest pumpkin in the patch. And I feel like she'll like this one a lot more than this one. So that's for a friend. And then last two things from Dollar General. I got these before I found that big gnome. So I'm going to be doing a Halloween giveaway. I'm going to pull all my Halloween stuff out. And I'm going to be adding um, a gnome to the giveaway. 
don't know which one yet. I haven't decided. Like I said, I need to pull all of them out that I've, because I've bought a few from the 99 cent store. So I want to see which ones I absolutely want and the ones that I don't mind, I will put in the giveaway. But I found these two and I just love uh, the, the socks just remind me, or the legs remind me of Beetlejuice, anything that's white and black stripes. So I do, I am keeping these two. I'm not giving these ones away. These were $4. And I just love how they switched the colors on them. Um, they're just so cute. And then this hat says boo. This one just has a bat on it. So I got those and that's it from Dollar General. The rest of this is from the 99 cent store. Um, I went in there to get something. I don't remember. My leg is falling asleep, sorry. And I do have a bag sitting right here. Um, oh, I wanted to get some window cleans for Shannon's bathroom. So I found this one and it says hello fall in the maple leaf and the flowers are really pretty and the acorns. So I'm going to put these in on her mirror plus, um, a few extra ones that I have, um, left over from mine that I didn't use. So those are going to go in her bathroom. And then I picked up some stuff for her goodie bags for her class. Um, there's 25 kids, 23, so you only get 20 in here, so that's not going to be enough. Um, so I picked up two and they're different boxes, so I can just mix them up and I'll keep the leftovers for me, um, because I will use the stickers for when I send out Halloween cards. But these are all the stickers that you get in there. And these are the stickers in this one so like I said I'll have extra but I will use them for sending out cards and then I picked up these cute little bubbles and you get six in here and I picked up four so if I have extra I'll just leave them here for the kids my kids love bubbles so I got those for her class um Leland was with me. Sorry, I need to just film this before um, I go lay them down um, because they're going to be right here and then they're going to hear everything. But um, I got a Leland wanted the watermelon rings, so I got a bag of those. And then one of the trips, Shannon was both of the kids were with me and she wanted sweetest fish, and I got these for her dad, their dad, because um, he loves these. I also picked up four things in my cookies because they were all stocked up on them, but one of them is open and in my cookie jar. So like I said, I picked up four, but I opened one to put in the cookie jar. And so I have three left. And then I picked up these for a friend. Um, I had picked her up. They're for Brittany's husband. He is a huge Peeps fan. And they've never seen these flavors before. So I'm going to add these in there for him. And this one is Peeps Fruit Punch. And then I got him Peeps Hot Tamales. And he's really excited to try these ones. He said the other two I got him were, he said the sour watermelon ones were so good. So those are going to be for him. Because they don't have a 99 cent store in Florida. And um, I just want to include something for him, you know, because... Brittany always puts candy in mine for my husband, so I'm going to put some little treats for him. Picked up these stackable books. It's just a, I don't even know what it's made out of. I think this was $2.49. The sticker came off of the bottom, um, but the top one says Witch's Brew. The middle one is Potions, and then the bottom one is Spooky Spells. And I tried fighting finding the best one that didn't have like if you can see right here it's kind of like all like the gold paint spread a little bit but they were all like this so but I love the look of these books I think they're so cool so I did pick up that then I also picked up this for a friend it's like the day of the dead because it says hola halloween this is a like a corpse bride looking one and here's like the groom. So those are for friends. They were 99 cents each. 
And then I found these gnomes before I found the ones at Dollar General. So like I said, I don't know which ones I'm going to put in the... Oh, yeah, the books were $2.49. Um, which, that's not bad for those. These ones, I saw... Oh, I don't know her channel name. She watches me, and I watch her. She does a lot of 99 cent store hauls as well. I saw her haul this one, and she said you could keep it out even for fall and Christmas because there's no pumpkin or jack-o'-lantern. It's just a black and white buffalo check hat, and that is so true. This one as well. The beard is different, though. Um, so I just got these two because they were 99 cents. Like I said, I found these before I found the ones at Dollar General. So I don't know if these are going in the giveaway or the other ones from dollar general or um the 99 cent store it's probably going to be this these two because the other ones shannon really likes that cat one so i don't know yet but i'll let you guys know and then i picked up two of these they're so cute i saw her haul this as well and i've seen this on instagram sorry my son was laughing making himself laugh so hard that he started coughing so i got this cute little sign I absolutely love everything about this. I love the little bow. I love the little tag. I love the font they chose. I love the little beads. This was $1.49. So I got two. And I just, I fell in love. So I got the last two that they had. And then I got this one. It has these cute little beads up here. And it just says, Happy Halloween. There's no glitter, so I fell in love with it. This was only 99 cents, so I got that one. Um, the only thing I would do is probably add more beads, um, just because I like more, but that's the only thing I would do to this. And then last few signs, and that'll be it for this video. Oh, real quick. These were thrown in like the kitchen area, so I just grabbed them. You get 12 sheets, and there's stickers. And they're like the alphabet, but they're uppercase and lowercase. So I picked up these for when I'm doing friend mail packages. And then I found this. It's a witch's hat with a broom. And then it has this hanging and it says Happy Halloween. And this was $1.49. So I got that. The checkered reminds me of like van slip-ons. So cute. And then I got this one that says it's just a bunch of hocus pocus and i love that her feet are sticking up there's no glitter on this it's so cute this was only 99 cents it's so adorable and then of course these ones you already know when i pick up two it's because i can't decide so this one there's a cat so i was like okay i have to get that i love that the license plate says october 31st this one says trick-or-treat and then I loved this one too because it says Happy, ha Happy Halloween, but I just like couldn't decide which one. So I ended up picking up both. Um, like I said, if I don't keep one, then I can always throw it in the giveaway or send it in friend mail to somebody, but I just thought these were so cute. So that's it for my collective haul, you guys. I was really excited to find the gnomes, finally get a tablecloth for my uh, table on the patio and the blanket. So like I said, I just have a few things to put out Oh, no, one more thing. I needed a trash can for outside, and it does say trash right here. I just loved the shape of it. I just got gray. I didn't really care what color. They had black, white, and like an aqua blue color. It was $2.99. Um, I just needed a new trash can, so that was the other reason why I went. So, now that's it for my <laughs> collective haul. Sorry about that. Um... Like I said, I have a few things left to do. It's mainly just Shannon's bathroom to put the clings on her mirror, put my tablecloth on my table, add my blanket to the couch, and then that's it. And then I can do my house tour. So that's it for this video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I would love for you to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.